We all know that giant animals and creatures exist, but that doesn't mean we've seen them for ourselves. Most of us probably haven't even seen footage of them. So if you have preconceived ideas about how large something is, you're probably going to be in for quite the shock. From a Komodo dragon to a crocodile, here are 20 giant creatures caught on camera. Number 20. Blue Whale In pictures, blue whales don't look all that large, but it's probably because we haven't sat something next to them in photos. They're usually just photographed in the expansive ocean with nothing to compare sizes like a car, although there's certainly no denying just how massive these marine mammals are. Blue whales are a type of baleen whale that can grow up to 98 feet or 29.9 meters long, weighing as much as 199 metric tons. They are the largest ever known animal to exist, and that hasn't changed in many, many decades. Blue whales have long, slender, grayish blue bodies, and populations of them live in the North Atlantic, North Pacific, Southern Ocean, Indian Ocean, South Pacific Ocean, and the Northern Indian Ocean. There are also thought to be some in waters off Chile. As large as they are, they don't feast on humans to satisfy their hunger. They are known as filter feeders, which means they mainly eat krill to sustain their heft. They are also primarily solitary animals and only occasionally gather in small groups. Unfortunately, as abundant as blue whales used to be, they no longer are. They are classed as endangered and still face many threats, such as climate change, pollution, ocean noise, and ship strikes. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 19. Giant Pacific Octopus it's all in the name, really. An animal called Giant Pacific Octopus is, of course, gonna be huge, and this marine cephalopod certainly is. Giant Pacific Octopuses, also known as North Pacific Giant Octopuses, can weigh up to about 33 pounds or 15 kilograms with an arm span of 14 feet or 4.3 meters. Even their suckers are impressive, spanning about 2.5 inches or 6.4 centimeters and supporting about 35 pounds or 16 kilograms in weight. These massive creatures live around the coastal areas of the North Pacific like California, Oregon, Alaska, British Columbia, and all the way to the Korean Peninsula. You may also discover them at about 6,600 feet or 2,000 meters in the coldest, most oxygen-rich waters. From what we currently know about all octopus species, they are the largest, with a scientific record of one weighing as much as 156 pounds. So if you see a massive octopus in a video or even in real life, there's every reason to believe it's one of these hefty fellas. Giant Pacific octopuses eat a wide-ranging diet of snails, lobsters, fish, cockles, shrimp, and even other octopuses. They use their suckers to nab whatever they find and then bite into them with their beak, which is made of chitin. Alongside being quite large, this marine species is also super bright. They are ranked as one of the most intelligent invertebrates and have been known to recognize humans they come into contact with. They can even open child-proof bottles and solve puzzles. This octopus is definitely an incredible species. Number 18. Giant Gippsland Earthworm if seeing worms in your garden makes you squeamish, then spare a thought for anyone who comes across a giant Gippsland earthworm in their backyard. This worm is so enormous that you might almost mistake it for a snake. And honestly, I don't know what's worse. The giant Gippsland earthworm is native to Australia and is definitely not your average earthworm. They are an average of 3.3 feet or 1 meter long and can be as thick as 0.79 inches or 2 centimeters. Some have even been found tripling the average length at almost 10 feet long, or 3 meters. 
Most of these earthworms weigh about 0.44 pounds and have blue-gray bodies with dark purple heads and up to 400 body segments. Basically, they're horrifying. If you're gonna find them anywhere, they will be in blue, gray, or red clay soils, typically present around hills and stream banks in Gippsland, Victoria. They tend to live in burrow systems and have pretty long lifespans. Most take around five years to reach maturity and will lay eggs to produce new baby worms in about 12 months. Now, unfortunately, Unfortunately, giant Gippsland earthworms are considered endangered, and no one has yet been able to breed them in captivity successfully. Number 17. Coconut Crab If you thought spiders were scary, then meet this creature that looks similar but possibly more terrifying. The Coconut Crab Coconut crabs are also referred to as palm thieves and robber crabs, and they are described as the largest terrestrial arthropod in the entire world. These crabs can weigh a whopping 9 pounds or 4.1 kilograms and can even measure up to 3 feet 3 inches or 1 meter long from one leg tip to the other. Their body lengths are about 16 inches and males tend to be larger than females. Coconut crabs live on islands surrounding the Pacific Ocean and the Indian Ocean and basically around areas with little to no humans since they probably know will eat them. Adult coconut crabs have a pretty exciting diet of nuts, seeds, fruit and fallen tree pith. but they They'll also eat organic matter and the decaying flesh of dead animals if they find it. Essentially, anything potentially edible on the ground is fair game, hence their name, Robber Crab. Even though their official name is Coconut Crab, they don't really eat coconuts. Instead, they just climb coconut trees and have been observed dislodging ripe fruit from trees while climbing them. Number 16. Giant Walking Stick if you get a bit squeamish around insects, be prepared for your stomach to do a few somersaults. The giant walking stick is one of those insects that would have you packing up your possessions and moving out if you found one in your bedroom. They are the largest of all North American walking sticks and can measure up to 6 inches or 15 centimeters long. Some have even been found longer than that. Honestly, I don't know if I'm okay with that. The problem with these insects is that they are masters of camouflage, so you may not know you're even near one until you're pretty much right beside it. They just look like sticks, twigs, or branches, and this helps them avoid detection by other animals that might like to eat them. Most have red, brown, or green bodies, and sometimes a combination of all three. Their feet tend to be browner, though, allowing them to mimic a dried-up stick. Female giant walking sticks are often larger than males, to the point where males sometimes hitch a ride on females and won't disembark until they die. The females don't even need the males since they can reproduce asexually. If she can't find a male, she'll just lay eggs herself in foliage and carry on her line without a male's input. Number 15. Komodo Dragon it's easy to assume that Komodo dragons will just be like blue-tongued lizards. Small, calm, and gentle, but they're pretty much the exact opposite of all those things. Instead, Komodo dragons are the heaviest, largest lizards in the world and are certainly not ones you'll want to approach since they have a venomous bite. They can grow up to 154 pounds or 70 kilograms in the wild, and the most giant verified dragon measured 10.3 feet or 3.13 meters long. It also tipped the scales at 366 pounds, or 166 kilograms. In general, males tend to be larger than females, but I wouldn't approach a male or a female if I were you. Even though human attacks are rare, they have happened, and people have died. As recently as 2009, a 31-year-old Komodo Island local was attacked by two Komodo dragons while picking apples, and he died from his injuries. There have also been reported attacks in 2017, with at least two people experiencing severe injuries after encounters with them. Their bites are no joke. They have powerful jaw and throat muscles that allow them to swallow huge chunks of meat, and they can consume up to 80% of their own body weight in one meal. They generally live on any kind of meat, especially meat they can scavenge from something as small as a rodent through to a massive water buffalo. Number 14. Giant or Fish 
The giant oarfish isn't exactly a fish that'll have you recoiling in horror if you see one. It's no great white shark, that's for sure. But it's certainly not a small fish, either. The giant oarfish from the oarfish family is the world's longest, boniest fish. They have a ribbon-shaped body with dorsal fins along their entire length, and it's believed that people see this fish when they claim to see giant sea serpents. The world's longest giant oarfish on record is 26 feet or 8 meters long, but unconfirmed sightings have been reported, with some as long as 36 feet or 11 meters. One was even found that tipped the scales at 600 pounds. This fish is found all around the world since it follows its food source and tends to live in a variety of environments up to depths of 3,300 feet. We don't know too much about them as far as behaviors go, but it's thought that they can swim in a vertical position. Footage taken from an ROV showed them swimming tail downward. As large as they are, their diets aren't as complex as you might expect. They mainly eat krill, small fish, squid, and small crustaceans, and they are primarily solitary when they mature. Number 13. Giant Oceanic Manta Ray Something doesn't get a name like Giant Oceanic Manta Ray without being, well, giant. And that's what this ray species is. Known as the Giant Oceanic Manta Ray, the Oceanic Manta Ray, and Giant Manta Ray, it is the largest ray type in the world. They are found worldwide in temperate waters, tropical waters, and subtropical waters, and they grow up to about 23 feet across. They also tip the scales at a whopping 6,600 pounds, or 3,000 kilograms. The average observed size is about 15 feet across. As you might expect from a large animal, they also have large brains, with the average giant oceanic manta ray brain weighing about 200 grams. This is up to 10 times larger than the brain of a whale shark, and is also considered the largest brain-to-mass ratio of any known fish species. Its brain is so giant that it seems to exhibit self-awareness, something you don't expect from most marine creatures. Like many marine creatures these days, the manta ray is classed as endangered, even though it has few natural predators. It's thought that overfishing has contributed to their declining numbers, including accidentally getting caught up in fishing equipment like bottom net sets. As they have a long gestation period and only one pup at a time, they may not be able to compensate for their losses over time, which may spell disaster for them in the future. Number 12. Giant Amazon Leech the Amazon rainforest spans many millions of miles and is home to about 10% of the world's biodiversity. The many streams and tributaries from the Amazon River also contain the world's largest number of freshwater fish species. It's probably not surprising for you to learn that the Amazon is home to some quite weird and wonderful critters, such as the giant Amazon leech. It's considered one of the largest leech species in the world and can grow up to 17.7 inches or 450 millimeters. It's also as wide as 4 inches, which is usually around its middle section before tapering off at the tail end. These gray-brown leeches feature unique patches and stripes in their coloring and can be spotted in the Guianas all the way to the Amazon. Surprisingly, we considered them extinct in the 1890s before they were found again in the 1970s. Dr. Roy Sawyer found one in French Guiana and formed a successful breeding colony from it at UC Berkeley. Giant Amazon leeches produce an anticoagulate protease hementin from their salivary glands, which means they can keep your blood flowing when they stab into your skin. As giant as they are, you probably won't even feel one latch onto your skin in the water. They stab rather than bite and have a 6-inch muscular tube like a tongue straw that they use to penetrate your skin hypodermically. Number 11. Giant African Land Snail when you see video footage of giant African land snails, you probably don't think they look that large. But then the camera zooms out and you gain some perspective. They are massive and make an adult's hands look small in comparison. Giant African land snails are about 2.8 inches in diameter and upwards of 7 inches long. They are one of the largest land snails in existence. They have conical shaped shells that are twice as long as they are wide, and their brown banded shells have the highest metal content of all snail species, so they aren't easy to break. Their robustness is probably one of the reasons they are considered a 
pest species in most parts of the world. They are native to East Africa, but have been observed in many parts of the world like China, India, and the United States. In these countries, they damage crops and native plants and can even spread human diseases. They are on the list of the most invasive species in the world. They tend to thrive in areas with mild climates and don't discriminate between urban and rural settings. If they like somewhere, they'll live there. It's believed that they manage to spread to many parts of the world through the pet trade as food and accidentally. Once their populations become established, there's just no slowing them down. They dine on pretty much all plant materials as well well as fruit, vegetables, paper, cardboard, and even sand. They can lay about 200 eggs in a clutch and have up to five to six clutches per year. So yeah, you can see why they're a bit of a problem. Number 10, Mysterious Sea Creature. Sometimes, when giant creatures are caught on camera, we only know them as giant creatures. It's not always clear what they actually are. That was the case when an unknown creature washed up on the shores of Acapulco Beach in Mexico in 2016. It was large, but it didn't have any defining features that would allow for easy identification. Instead, it was just this large, grayish, squishy thing that people turned up in their droves to see and poke with sticks. According to Civil Protection and Fire Coordinator Sebas de la Rose Camacho, the unknown creature washed up on the beach but didn't have a foul smell like you would expect something dead and rotting to have. Even prodding it with sticks didn't make it emit any smell. It was described as being about 13 feet long with bones, which made Sabas believe it might have been a whale or squid of some kind. It had apparently spent a lot of time floating in strong currents before washing up onto the beach and luring in tourists who had been staying at the nearby resort. As gross as this carcass was, it generated a lot of buzz, and videos of it were shared over 100,000 times on social media. Number 9. 30-Foot Anaconda Anacondas are a boa species from South America known as one of the heaviest and longest snakes in the world. One of the world's longest is the green anaconda, known to grow as long as 17.1 feet or 5.21 meters. There have also been reports of some measuring between 35 and 40 feet. But those claims are unfounded, thank goodness. Although, one claim that's hard to dispute is the one involving Brazilian construction workers in 2012. They were shocked to discover a 33-foot-long, 900-pound anaconda on their work site. They had to use a crane just to get it out of the area so they could get back to work. Pictures of the anaconda didn't look edited in any way, shape, or form, so it's highly likely that this snake really was 33 feet long. However, this story didn't have a happy ending. The snake appeared to be dead, and people speculated whether the construction workers killed it while removing it. They never made it clear how it died, and no one came forward to verify the facts of what happened. Without that snake alive, the current longest snake held in captivity is one called Medusa. She is a 25-foot-long reticulated python that lives in Kansas City, owned by Full Moon Productions Incorporated. Number 8. Giant Crocodiles Crocodiles are semi-aquatic reptiles that live in Australia, the Americas, Africa, and Asia. Their sizes vary depending on their species, with saltwater crocodiles growing up to 23 feet long and weighing 2,200 pounds, and dwarf crocodiles reaching lengths of just 6.2 feet. Although some crocodiles are certainly larger and more impressive than others, and seeing them on camera reminds you just how important it is to give these reptiles their space. For example, Brutus, the 80-year-old giant crocodile, is famous in Australia. He's a 5.5 meter or 18 foot croc who's been captured on camera with a bull shark in his mouth. He's also quite often spotted on river tours held on the Adelaide River. Then there's Cassius, a 5.48 meter or 17.97 foot croc that holds the Guinness World Record for the largest crocodile in captivity. He lives in far north Queensland, weighs over one ton, and is thought to be over a century old. The previous world record was in the Philippines, held by Lo Long. He was 6.17 meters or 20.24 feet before he died in 2013. In the wild, the biggest crocodile currently alive is believed to be Gustav, who lives in Burundi, East Africa, in the Ruzizi River. He's about 6 meters or 19.68 feet long, and is believed to be responsible for at least 100 human deaths while living near Lake Tanganyika. Number 7. Atlas Moth 
Most moths you come into contact with around your home are nothing more than inconvenient. They're only small, so you can hit them away from your face and even stop them from eating your beloved brassicas. But if you were to try pushing away an atlas moth, it might just punch you in the face. Well, not really, but they are massive, so they're probably entirely capable. Atlas moths are giant Saturnid moths from the forests of Asia. Their wingspan measures 9.4 inches or 24 centimeters, and they have a wing surface area of about about 25 inches squared. You might notice quite quickly that their wings are disproportionately larger than their bodies, but they are definitely beautiful. Their wings have a red-brown coloring with black, pink, white, and purple on the top and much paler colors underneath. Their forewings also have extensions at the tip and markings that look eerily similar to snake heads. You might think that given their size, they must eat a lot to stay alive, but that's not the case. Once they emerge from their cocoons, these giant moths only live on fat storage for their energy. Each time time they hoist their massive bodies off the ground to fly, they're dipping into those reserves and shortening their lifespan. Most atlas moths will only live one to two weeks, and their quality of life is pretty rubbish if you ask me. The females just wait for a male to come and fertilize them so they can lay eggs and die. Number 6. Capybara you picture rats and mice when you think about rodents, but what about the capybara? This fascinating cavy rodent from South America is the largest living rodent in the world. They look like a cross between a guinea pig and a rat with stocky, barrel-shaped bodies, short heads, and red-brown fur. They can also grow up to 4.4 feet long, or 134 centimeters, and stand at 24 inches tall at the withers. Most capybaras weigh up to 146 pounds, averaging around 108 pounds. Well, you might find rats and mice living in little hidey holes around your home. That won't be the case for capybaras. They live in dense forests and savannas near bodies of water and generally in groups of 10 to 20 and up to 100. Just like mice and rats, they are also not considered a threatened species, although they are regularly hunted for the grease from their fatty skin alongside their hide and meat. As large as they are, capybaras don't sustain their size by eating other animals. They are semi-aquatic herbivores and eat grass, aquatic plants, fruit, and tree bark. They're also pretty fussy and have select plants they like to eat rather than just feasting on what's available. Even though they can live up to about a decade in the wild, they rarely live that long. Most live less than four years because they are a preferred food source for animals like pumas, jaguars, and even eagles. Number 5. Feral Jellyfish there are over 2,000 known species of jellyfish in the world, but few are perhaps as giant and mind-boggling as the barrel jellyfish. These jellyfish are typically 16 inches in diameter, but can also grow up to 59 inches in diameter and even larger, making them the largest known jellyfish around Irish and British waters. Most people won't come into contact with these massive creatures, but wildlife biologist Lizzie Daly had that very opportunity in 2019. She and underwater cinematographer Dan Abbott came face to face with one the size of a human while diving off the coast of Cornwall in the UK. They spotted it near Falmouth, and Lizzie described the experience as breathtaking. She said it was an unforgettable experience because even though she knew they could grow quite big, she had never seen anything like this one before. She added that it was as big as she was. However, it's worth pointing out that lion's mane jellyfish do tend to be larger. Barrel jellyfish are not only giant but they are known to be moderately venomous. If you touch one, you may experience ulcers, a burning sensation on your skin, and dermatitis. However, they don't generally pose a serious threat to humans. Number 4. Spiders even small spiders have people screeching and grabbing a broom, so can you imagine how people react when they see some of the most enormous spiders in the world? I'd be packing my bags and moving out. That house belongs to the spiders now. Some pretty massive spiders and tarantulas have been caught on camera, such as goliath bird eaters, giant huntsman spiders, and Brazilian salmon pink bird eaters. Goliath bird eaters are absolutely massive and are described as the largest spider in the world. Their body mass can reach up to 6 ounces 
ounces, and they have a huge 12-inch body span with a foot-wide leg span. While they might have eaten the odd bird from time to time, they primarily feast on lizards, mice, and arthropods. Giant huntsman spiders are less beefy, but are by no means less terrifying. They have 12-inch bodies and the longest leg span of all known spiders at 11.8 inches long. They're also venomous, and a bite from this fella can be painful. Uh, let's not forget the Brazilian salmon pink bird eater. These northeastern Brazil tarantulas have 1-inch long fangs, an 11-inch body, and a 10-inch leg span. When fully mature, their bodies are about 6 inches in diameter. Number 3. Knickers the Cow Bovines aren't exactly small, and at least 22 deaths are reported in the U.S. each year related to cows. They kill more people than wolves do. It's their heft, of course. But there's one bovine that you might see as more capable of accidentally killing a human than others, and that's Knickers the Steer. The Holstein Frisian Steer from West Australia is believed to be one of the largest in the country, standing at almost 7 feet tall and weighing about 1,400 kilograms or 3,086 pounds. He's so large that he avoided slaughter because his size made him unfit for export. So he gets to live out his time on the farm he was reared, a property owned by Jeff Pearson. According to Jeff, even though he wasn't able to send knickers to slaughter, he has proven immensely helpful on the farm. Jeff says other cattle gravitate toward him, making it easier for him to spot his herd while they're grazing. But if he was to be butchered, which rest assured he's not, he would produce about 635 kilograms of trimmed beef, which would be enough for 370 kilograms of mince and 450 cuts of steak. Number 2. Deep Sea Creature the ocean is full of mysteries, and we'll likely never come to understand all of them. Although, we do encounter the odd mystery from time to time that we try to get to the bottom of. For example, in 2017, footage from a remote-operated vehicle revealed a massive set of bones with an intact spinal column spanning about 30 meters or 98 feet long. A diver operating the remote vehicle discovered the set of bones, and that diver sent the footage to a paranormal researcher, Deborah Hatswell. Deborah had no luck comparing the bones to any possible sea life in the area, and even the spinal column of whales, sea snakes, and oarfish came up far too short. So she uploaded the video to YouTube in hopes that someone else might have some answers. The diver believes that the bones may be far more ancient and might belong to something that doesn't exist anymore. Although people were quick to offer their theories online, with ideas like a sea dragon or the fossils of a Tylosaurus. Others believe it's something as innocent as a hammerhead shark or decomposed whale. Number 1. Cassowary Say the bird name cassowary and someone somewhere is shaking in their boots. Sure, these birds don't look nasty, but they most certainly are. They are flightless birds native to New Guinea and also live in Australia. The southern cassowary is the second heaviest living bird and the third tallest. And many people also say they are the world's most dangerous birds. Sure, they look innocent as they go about their lives, feasting on fruit and plant food, but if provoked, they are capable of inflicting severe damage on humans and other animals. Soldiers during World War II were warned to stay clear of them when stationed in New Guinea, and they've even killed people. The first documented death was in 1926 in Australia when one kicked a 16-year-old boy in the neck, severing his jugular vein. In 2019, a 75-year-old man in Florida also died after the cassowary he had raised clawed him to death when he fell on the ground. Sadly, a dog also died in 1995 when a cassowary struck it in the abdomen, causing intense intestinal rupture. Most of us probably knew that all of these animals existed, but their sizes were perhaps a little shocking. Did you know these animals were as large as they seem in video footage? Have you seen any in person? Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time!